and welcome to the club. With its iconic garlands and elegant deer silhouette, it's easy to design a home decor piece you will love to greet the coming season with style. Your Club Couture shipment this month comes with the versatile Seasons Greeting Transfer and a holiday palette of candy apple red, meadow green, and black velvet chalkology paste. Let me show you how quick and easy this comes together. The surface I've chosen today is the 9x12 Reclaimed Metal Tray. Its bright white finish will make these elements just pop. I've gathered some other tools here as well, and I'll explain them as I go. The first step is to use my transfer trimmers to cut apart the transfer along the cut lines. The different elements here allow you to design something truly custom. I'll press this first piece down on our fuzzing cloth, or you could just use a towel of your own, and this picks up a bit of lint to ease the adhesive and makes it less likely to stretch when peeling it off the surface. I'll place the arched pine right at the top and get it smoothed out so there are no wrinkles or bubbles. I'll do the same with the next piece too, the straight pine garland, and I'll position it near the bottom of the tray. I'll prep my first paste color, I'm using meadow here, by kneading the packet a bit just to make sure the paste is well mixed and ready to go. I'll tear off the corner, then squeeze some out on my small color tray. I'll do the same with each paste packet so I'm ready to work with all three colors. And now for the fun part. I'll start with my multi-tool and load it up with paste, then smooth it over the screened area. The detail side of this tool has a really small squeegee that makes it perfect for pasting carefully around the berries. Once I've got all the greenery covered, I'll use a clean multi-tool to go back in and chalk the berries. Now I'll peel this transfer back, finding the corner first, but then pulling straight from the side. Oh, I'm loving that! I'll set this piece aside to clean later, and then I'll do the same on the garland portion below. You can see it really doesn't require a lot of paste, so you've got plenty of meadow green and candy apple red to use for another quick holiday project. I've got the screen covered and the excess scraped off, so I'll peel this piece as well. There, that is making such a nice frame for the other pieces. I'll fuzz the deer silhouette too, and then tuck it right up into the arch. Now this overlaps a bit, but the top has had a minute to dry, so I'm not too worried about it smudging, but I won't press the corners down just to be safe. For this element, I'm using a small squeegee and loading up the black velvet paste. Now it's been sitting in the open air for a minute, so mixing it with a squeegee will help to make sure it's ready to go. Then I'll just smooth it over the deer, and this squeegee is like the perfect width, and scrape off the excess. Then carefully lift the corner and peel this straight down. I've got my last piece here and it's going to be fuzzed just like the others. This metal tray is non-porous, so it can really stick. Fuzzing helps a ton. I'll lay it down in this open spot and smooth it out. I've got a clean small squeegee here, which I'll load up with some more candy apple red, chalk it carefully, remove the excess, then at last peel the transfer. And there it is. So quick, so cute. You'll want to put up your holiday decor right away to give this lovely piece some company. You could use these transfer elements on other smaller pieces, mixing and matching them however you choose. You can always design, love, and repeat. With Club Couture, your next masterpiece is just around the corner. Happy chalking!